Good afternoon and thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day to join us on the tour of 213 Fun Avenue. Today we find ourselves in the waterfront community of Two Rivers Mobile Home Park. It is an age qualified community, but they do entertain folks of all ages. For you investors out there, they also allow rentals here. So you have a waterfront community that does allow rentals. So if you're looking to own a home and uh, offset the carrying costs or have it as a passive investment property, look no further than this beautiful redone one bedroom, one bath mobile home here in sunny Bradenton, Florida. Where we stand right now, we're about 15 minutes away from the Gulf of Mexico, about five minutes away from I-75, but I'll take you anywhere in the uh, Gulf Coast of Florida. Shopping and dining is right outside of the community, as well as medical facilities. Lot rent, let's talk about lot rent real fast. Lower than the county lot rent average by about $100. So very affordable living right on the water down the street from the beach. So without further ado, let's take a look at 213 Fun Avenue and see if it just lives up to the name or if it's just a clever street title. So with that being said, for starters, we'll take a look at the large uh, uh, palm tree here, beautiful right in the front yard. The park does take care of the lawn maintenance. Okay, so they're gonna be cutting your grass here. That's included in the uh, in the lot rent fee. First up as we approach the home, so many things to talk about here. Very rarely do I get this excited about a property. This is one of them. We have a, a very large carport. The owner drives a very large vehicle uh, and they have plenty of room to park as well as this parking pad over on the side. Now it is pavers. Okay, it's not concrete, it is pavers. But if you move your car up all the way, you'll be able to fit another two cars here. So perfect for entertaining. If you're coming off the boat, you wanna hang out and uh, hang out at your house, you got plenty of uh, spots to stay here. Speaking of hanging out on the boat, there is a uh, boat launch here just down the street. So calling all you water folks who wanna live the outdoor Florida lifestyle, look no further than this property. I wanna show you the brand new shed that they put in. This is gonna be coming with the property, okay? No storm damage on the shed or no, no storm damage with any of the house during the hurricane. Uh, the shed is just a few months old. So you see it's on papers there as well. That's gonna be coming with the home. Now, a couple of things in the exterior here. This uh, screen and porch area has been uh, built out recently. They did put two, um, uh, two doors on it. Okay, so you have a side door here and then door right into the carport. The security lattice that was put up there has a little bit uh, added uh, security for when you're hanging out and enjoying the evening. Nice exterior light here. Take a look at this one. Now, so many things to take a look at here. Let's go ahead and jump through all the, the main points. First up is this flooring. Okay, it's a vinyl, distressed beech wood there, nice and solid. The subflooring was completely redone with three quarter inch plywood, as was the two by eight support beams uh, by the previous owner. The overflooring obviously is brand new, looks fantastic. We have new windows throughout the home. Do not have the original windows in here at all. So new windows throughout the, uh, throughout the property. We also have the base trim here. It's been completely painted to a very coastal cottage feel. This is one of the few uh, mobile homes that you'll see uh, with the double pane roof, as you see here. So when we get out in the living room, it's actually higher than it is the rest of the house. Now, they have this custom built in here, which is beautiful. Nice solid countertops, nice solid uh, slow close cabinets. They have it built out as a home office. You could also use it as a coffee bar, uh, kind of a, a, a buffet if you were having people over, you name it. Now the stainless steel appliances are all going to stay with the home, refrigerator, and the stove. Now let's talk about the stove. This is a gas stove. Uh, so all you chefs out there, this is going to be exactly what you're looking for. The stove has actually never been used. It's fully functional. It's brand new. Uh, stainless steel there on the um, uh, microwave as well, and just tons of cabinets all throughout. Now the solid surface countertops, 
they carry over. Nice backsplash. It's not a cheapy backsplash either, folks. That's really in there. New sink. And then the underlit light as well. Uh, so if you're doing some dishes, then you have uh, plenty of uh, light there. It's tons of natural light throughout this entire property. Now, when we get through the hallway, we've got two storage areas, okay? Usually don't have one. This house has two. So the first one we're gonna be in here, this is gonna be some house knickknacks. We use as a pantry, kind of a catch-all. And then we have a second one here. Same thing, linens, that type of stuff. So tons of storage. New doors throughout the entire home. And that's gonna lead us directly into this beautiful master bath. Now the raised vanity is, uh, is quite nice, as is the double pane uh, mirrors. Now those mirrors do open up, so they are actually two um, medicine cabinets for privacy purposes. I obviously don't want to open them too, too far, but you get the idea. And then the shower stall and the new toilet. As we enter the master bedroom, you'll see just how large this is. That's a queen bed. And there's two separate closets areas, areas here and there as well. And the new windows on the far side and the AC. Now, I understand what people are gonna say. It does not have central AC, I get it. But you do have these two uh, nearly brand new window units that are keeping the house awfully cool. And then we also have the new fans in the living room and in the bedroom there as well. Another point I wanna add to here is that this is not gonna be paneling. Okay, so this is going to be sheetrock that's been built out, painted and mudded, which is quite nice. Outside Florida rooms, great place to enjoy your evening. There's plenty of power, as uh, shown by the laundry units here. Now, the owner is not totally sure if those units are going to stay or if they're going to replace them with other units, but there will be a laundry set here. Uh, which is very unique. Most of these homes in this community uh, don't have their own laundry. Now they also painted the concrete here with an indoor-outdoor stain, which is nice, easy cleanup, with no issues whatsoever. Um, they also have it wired as well for a fan. They didn't quite get to that job, which is totally fine, but you'll see there's just plenty of power in here to run that. Man, is that just something? For a smaller house, it lives big. And boy, is it just cute as a button. So as we finish up on 213 Fun Avenue, let's go ahead and go over the main points here. Okay, you have a nearly brand new home, new subfloors, new overflooring. The electrical panel, I forgot to mention that, the electrical panel has been completely redone in the house. Several thousand dollars. Got new appliances. No damage whatsoever from the, the hurricane. New windows throughout. Uh, the list just keeps adding up and adding up and adding up as far as how much money has been spent on this unit. New lighting fixtures throughout, new fans, new exterior lights. So many things. House has just recently been pressure washed throughout the entire property. So just a ton of love and care has been put into this property and ready for the next person to, uh, to jump on and enjoy, enjoy this property. And you'll see right through the video behind the stop sign is your water view that you do get from enjoying your cup of coffee in the living room. So 213 Fun Avenue offers just so much for the new owner. Uh, like we mentioned before, you have lower lot rent for the county. You're directly on the water. You can rent this if you want to offset your carrying costs or use it as an investment property. And last but not least, we do have a motivated seller here on our hands. So please bring offers. Guys, if you're not yet a member of the channel, please uh, do us a favor and subscribe below so that you're up to speed with everything that's going on with everything at the mobile home dealer, our updated videos, our how-to channels, as well as our budget channel that gets a lot of views on that as well. This is Mark with the mobile home dealer. Thank you so much for joining us on the tour of 213 Fun Avenue. 
We'll see y'all on the next one.